Hello, I'm Teacher Dale. Welcome to class. Today's lesson is about the letter A. Let's get started. Did you know the letter A is a vowel? Now, letters are in two types, consonants and vowels. Vowels are A, I, E, O, and U. Now, the letter Y is a magic letter, I say. It can be used as a consonant or a vowel, depending on the sentence. And that is for another lesson. Today, we're learning about the letter A. Now, there are hundreds of words with the letter A. So today, we are just going to find words, and we're going to see how the vowels are in words. So let's get started. The first word we're going to look at is able. Jack is able to come to class. After. Let's go to the mall after class. Animal. The animal lives on a farm. So what kind of animals live on a farm? Can you write up in the comments below, please? Now, one thing we must never do is the next word, asleep. You don't want to fall asleep. So don't fall asleep in class. A sign. The teacher did not assign homework. Yay, no homework. <laughs> the teacher did not assign homework. Now, we have words that have the letter A. Those words began with an A. These are words that have a letter A in them. Bag. Please bring me a bag. Ball. This is a basketball. Band. We like this band. What kind of music do you like? Would you write it in the comments part below for me, please? See, this is how students participate in class. They type comments. In our class, everyone can participate. No one is left out. Bank. Joe is at the bank. Call. Please call the mom. Can. You can learn English. You're going to do great in class. Can is very important. It shows what you're able to do. We used able earlier. Cap. This is a baseball cap. Cat. Her cat is orange. Class. We have a wonderful class. And if you haven't subscribed and you haven't become a member of our class, please think about joining our class. We'd love to have you. It would be very wonderful to see you in class. More words with the letter A. Dad. Sam is his dad. Family. Andy has a large family. Farm. The goat lives on a farm. Gas. The car needs gas. Hat. This is a tan hat. Sad. So, the cat is sad. Why is the cat sad? If you know why the cat is sad, would you type it in the comments below? Sad. Amber sat in a chair. Water. The water is fresh. Now, 
we have two kinds of water. We have salt water and we have fresh water. If you know where we can find salt water, would you type it in the comments for us, please? Watermelon. Watermelon. Four syllables. We can eat watermelon. If you like to eat watermelon, would you type yes in the comments below? Yes, I like watermelon. Yes. Now, how to use the word apple in sentences. This apple is red. This apple tastes good. We see an apple tree. Do you see an apple tree? Do you like apples? Do you like to eat apples? Yes, I like to eat apples. No, I do not like to eat apples. Okay, now we're going to talk about art for a minute. Art, A-R-T, also the letter A. What you see here is a photograph. Now, do you think photographs are art? Will you tell me yes or no in the comments? Yes, photographs are art. No, they are not art. This picture here, this photograph, do you like it? If you like the photograph, would you type in the comments what you like about the photograph? If you don't like it, would you let us know? Now, just so you know, yes, I took the photograph, and the photograph was taken in the Philippines, just so you know where the photograph was taken. And I'm just curious to see what your thoughts are about it. Um, anyway, let's go on to our next one. Auto is short. For automobile. The words auto and car have the same meaning. Now, they are spelled differently, they sound differently, but they mean essentially the same thing. Did you take your car to the auto repair shop? Yes, I did take my car to the auto repair shop. No. I did not take my car to the auto repair shop. Now, we have our lesson review. Can you think of another word with the letter A? Please use it in a sentence. Please write it in the comments below. Like we said earlier, there are hundreds of words with the letter A. Today, we can only begin to use a few of them. This is a basic class. It's just something so it's just to get you to think, so that you're able to practice your English. And hopefully, you've got something that you can remember about the class and show a reason to you why you want to keep taking your classes. Now, the next class is going to be about the letter B. If you enjoyed the class today, would you give it a like? And if you want to become a member of our class, would you please subscribe to the channel? And you know what? It's time to say goodbye. I appreciate all of my students. Thank you so much for being in class today. Please come back to class again. I want to see you again in class. And today we're going to say goodbye. And you have a wonderful day.